Hey everybody, what's good? Mid-morning soul back at it again, and folks, a different video. I know, usually I do my gameplay videos, but I just had to talk about it. So, what you're looking at right here, right? It is my dead wallet, as you can see, top left-hand corner. Why would I name it that, you may ask? Well, reason for that being, and I'll show y'all, but let me do a little quick maneuvering here. Forgot to turn on Do Not Disturb because I don't want any mm, pop-ups while I'm recording this video. But y'all, the reason why I call it the dead wallet is because I goofed. This was my first uh, DeFi wallet. And I thought, for some odd reason, I don't know why if I didn't, uh, whatchamacallit, if I didn't write down the words or there was no option as to writing down the words or, um, I don't know. When I created the Y, I just boop, 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 created it, synced it to my main account, and it was a deal, right? But now, I, like, uh, I had this realization uh, December <laughs> or January, I don't know. Like, it was a month ago. So I'm frantically looking around. I'm, like, I have my special slip of paper that I write all of my, uh, whatchamacallit, my passphrases on, and it's locked up. It's, like, fucking valuable, right? But I don't know why, y'all. I don't know why. I, For some odd reason, I don't think it showed up. I didn't do it. Whatever the case may be, right? So I was frantically trying to get a hold of customer service. I was like, yo, yo, can you like reset my password? Can you, re or not reset my password, reset my status, whatever, like they did with the uh, uh, CDC breach that happened not too long ago. I think it was like two weeks ago or some shit. But um, no, they were like, no, it's DeFi. The thing with DeFi is it's all in your hands, which I know now. But they were telling me, oh, you know, maybe try this, maybe try that. Like, ultimately, y'all, they told me, well, we can't really help you. Like, if you don't have the keys, that it, the, the, whatever is in there is lost. So, I'll show y'all that I tried to, you know, I'm not going to show y'all. If I could get my recovery phrase, that would be a miracle, but... Well, actually, protect your wallet, right? Oh, I thought I was being real spiffy with the 2FA, but I borked myself. So, biometrics you can deal with, no problem. Passcode, no worries. Recovery phrase. So, when I first realized this, I was like, oh shit, I don't have like access to my funds. So I try to write my recovery phrase down. Okay, it prompts me to do this, which I was thinking, okay, yeah. So it prompts me to do the 2FA. Now, I thought when I sync this up with my Crypto.com app, it took... Like, they were one and the same, but they're not. So, all, all, all in all, y'all, <laughs> it's real bad, right? And I'll show you. So, I gathered the code really quickly. I'm just going to punch it in. No, right? And you know the funny thing is they spelled failed wrong. They put fied attempts. Like, what the fuck? Get your shit together, CDC, D5. But yeah, this is what I would see. 
And I was freaking out because I was like, huh? Didn't I set it up with the so-and-so? At first, I set it up with... Um, at first, I set it up with a Google Authenticator. But then they were like, no, use Authy. So I switched after the incident. I switched to Authy because I heard less hangups with that one. And so... You know, for the main app, I had no problems. But with this, I wasn't like I wasn't sure what was going on. So let's just back out of here, right? Can't do that because the two FAs borked. Now, I have the wallet. I have the wallet connected to my main account because. I'm going to try to, <laughs> I know it's probably moot at this point. It's not going to work, but hey, it doesn't hurt to try, right? So, um, I'm going to keep it connected, but I'm going to delete the app and re-download it. And folks, not to be remiss, I do have a new wallet. So you can see here. I aptly named it a live wallet because it is alive. I created the new wallet, in fact, and Defo wrote my passphrase down. And then I just built it up my funds again. So when we go into, because I will do more videos on this, y'all. But when we go into uh, like some of the projects that I'm passionate about, Defo, Defo, Defo will um, show y'all the other wallet. <laughs> Excuse me. But for now, I'm just going to try to do this. I don't know. This was a fun little... Uh, at least I figured it out now versus when I sunk in, like, more, you know, money. So, y'all, this is what's hurting me the most. I have now 700 and something dollars in Crow that's being staked, chain staking, right? I bought this last year, this, um, the 1499, I bought it for $150. You know what $150 uh, gets you now, right? It's not in the thousands, okay? But, yeah, yeah, I was like, yeah, let me stake it. Let me, um, I'm going to make bank off this. This is going to be cool. Oh, my gosh. Let me go ahead and unstake my claim and, and claim rewards because it's over 100. You, you can't do that. Or can you? Because watch what happens. Boop! I'm brought back here. So with the Bork 2FA, I'm stuck here. Okay, so I can't even do that. Uh, what I can do is compound it, I guess. Can I? Nope, can't do that either. So, folks, this is like a how not to make a wallet. <laughs> I, yeah, y'all, I can't tell you how angry I was. I cannot tell you how angry I was when I found out. But, like I said, at least I found out yesterday and not today when I sunk in X amount of money, right? So, can't, can't, can't do anything now that the crow is just staking and built on that right can't do anything so then we're gonna go to i was like all right i've had it um shit hold on i'm like how do i get the two wallets on oh yeah it's right here all right i'm going to remove wallet from device I can't do that because I don't have the passphrases. So, like, what's good? I can't even do that. 
So, um, yeah, I mean, I wish I would have known, like, better on how to deal with these, like, DeFi wallets. But this was a, this was a bot lesson. Unfortunately, I cannot reap the benefits of my $150 investment. And then also, yeah, y'all, I sunk in some of my Shiba profits um, into here too, but that's in VVS uh, DeFi. Not too much though, but I mean, still, it kind of hurts to look at because it's like, well, shit, that's what I had, you know? So, let me see. Yeah, this is just a memorial service for my dead wallet because I'll show y'all what my new wallet, my alive wallet's all about. Much better, right? So, I'm going to get into like talking about like what I love like what I love about this wallet. Um Unfortunately, not too much, like, not too much crazy stuff going on. Like, I didn't turn 100 into 1,000 or whatever. But I did, you know, I, I am up on Tectonic, and that's a different animal. But we can talk about that later, y'all. Um, This is what I want to do. But don't worry, y'all. I do have the passphrase for this wallet. So I want to you know, get started with, you know, the crow. But, yeah, something like that. Okay. And then, I know what, I know what um, validator I'm going to use. But this is why I'm doing this right now. Woo! And the the new wallet doesn't work with um the new like it has the old wallet features locked in which doesn't make sense. So not to worry like I'm not stressed out at all. It's just y'all know why I'm doing it now cuz I can't stake on um, my new wallet because of the old wallet features. And I'm like, well, that's so dumb. Like, why the hell is it this much of a problem, you know, to be able to stake? Because that's what I've been trying to do this whole time. So what I'm going to end up doing, y'all, is I'm going to um, delete the app. So we're just going to have to say, you like my wallet avatar? Yes, God, I love me some mold. I'm really, I'm really loving VVS, y'all. I, 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 I cannot tell you how much I love VVS. But um, yeah, we're just gonna say goodbye to this wallet because, damn man, unfortunately it impedes me, and um, I, I'm not sure what the address is. Ah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm trying to think on how to, how can I keep the address? And I'll, I'll take that off screen. But what I wanted to show y'all was what I was working with for VVS for the dead wallet. I'll show you the alive wallet later, but the dead wallet, because it's going to go boom, boom. Um... Yeah, this was, I was staking from, when was I staking? Oh, uh, I can't remember. I know I got in when it, the project was announced on Crypto.com. And then I didn't know any better. So I was buying directly off of Crypto.com. That's a whole nother uh, video, y'all, in which, you know, as much as I love Crypto.com, got to be honest. They do some scummy shit, too. But, um, yeah. I got in when the APY was like, so, so delicious. So juicy. 
And yeah, this is beating my Alive wallet, which has more funds, but less uh, platform yield as of right now. So uh, the APY was juicier when I got in with this wallet. And then, um, yeah, the farms. Oh, the farms, y'all. This is my biggest farm. And then when it was real juicy, yes, I got like a, over a million VVS here. So can't do anything with this wallet, y'all. And it's just going to suck up the funds. And then, um, uh, ugh, ugh, uh, it pains me. It pains me so, y'all. Ugh, ugh, ugh. Yes, over 3 million for, or, yeah, over 3 million, but, like, 2.5 just from farming 325 of USDT VVS. And keep in mind, like, I don't usually, you know, I don't fuck with Tether like that, but it is what it is. <laughs> so I'm just saying goodbye, y'all, and let this be a cautionary tale of what not to do when setting up this wallet. You do want to have your keys. Treat your keys, your passphrase, whatever, like your life dependent on it. If you're putting in serious money, what serious money, whatever you determine it to be, uh, doesn't matter if it's a thousand like mine or a hundred or fifty, whatever you consider to be um, very valuable, don't do what I did. And I didn't even think Crow was Crow Coin was gonna shoot up like it did last year, but it did late last year. And I'm happy, but I'm sad because of that. Like if it was just $150, then oh oh well, I just lost out on that wallet. But we don't know what the future holds for Crow, but I see it to be a bright future. And um yeah, let's go ahead and delete the or uninstall the program and then reinstall it so i do have it connected to crypto.com because like i said i don't know if that'll do anything probably won't it'll probably just delete everything from the phone but um yeah y'all rest in peace my sweet first wallet your spirit shall live on in the Alive Wallet. <sighs> it's been fun, y'all. So I'll show y'all the aftermath. If I was... So if, so if a miracle turns around or not. But I'm not getting my hopes up. Alright, y'all. So I uninstalled. And I am about to import the Alive Wallet. So... I'm... I... You know, it hurts, y'all. It hurts. But it is what it is. I had to do it. I had to. I had to. So, y'all, I will cut, of course, because y'all ain't going to see my, um, the process of me putting my stuff in. But, um, I'll just cut back to when the video goes to, um, when everything is back up. So, see you then. We did it. <laughs> oh, it hurt my soul so much to do it, but I'm glad. So instead of Google Authenticator, um, I decided to roll with Authy. And um, damn, 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 damn. All right. I think this is where I enter my recovery phrase. So give me a second. <laughs> I had to do it, y'all. I had to. I had to. The Phoenix wallet rises from the ashes. It had to be done, y'all. Yeah, and then my NFAs aren't showing up. Um, and then 
As you can see, the dead wallet is gone. I can't get it. So, it just is what it is. That's the dead wallet. So, folks, that's how not to create a dead wallet. <laughs> Don't do it. Make sure you have your passphrase. Keep it up locked, safe, and tight. Trust. Like I said, I was caught slipping. And now, the thing cost me, what? Who knows how much VVS and Crow that that would cost me. But, you know, it is what it is. That That's my con contribution to Burn Society. You can't say Mid Morning Soul ain't a um, supporter of burning. <laughs> so, that whatever is being accumulated, y'all, that is burnt. And, um, yeah. <laughs> oh, it hurts. It hurts, y'all, but whatever it is, what it is. So, folks, I'm going to ease the pain by... <laughs> no, not that. Um, shucks, y'all. I am going to ease the pain. No. I want to deposit. Oh, oh my. Where all this other shit come from? Okay, I'll do that off camera. Uh, but da but da but da but da. DeFi earn. Yes. Okay. Max amount. Yes. Proceed. Don't ask any questions. Do not ask any questions. Uh. See, look at all this. This used to be like um. Where is it? Gosh darn it. Voting power. Okay. So, folks, I'm actually going to choose Jerry's pool because I've heard good things about it. Okay, zero commission, which is pretty, pretty boss. So yeah, let's go ahead and stake it. And then, yes, folks, when you do use DeFi Earn, um, you have a 28-day, damn near a month, that your funds are not available. So keep that in mind. You see Crow rising, and um, you want a piece of that, well... If, you know, if it ain't just a weird shoot up and then plump, uh, dump, then, you know, I wouldn't f uh, fidget with this. But it's not locked. It's just that it's just a 28-day waiting period for you to get access to your funds again. So I know this. I'm going to say don't show me again. And proceed, please. All right. Aha! Now I can use it. Hold on, y'all. Okay. Ah! Yeah, it works! Ah! Yes! So, the 1500 that I was staking, you know, yeah, it's up in smoke, but here, 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 look at that. Look at that juicy 10,000. Like, yeah, I sold some more of my Shiba, but... It is what it is. Why? What are y'all doing? Okay. Yeah. All right. So, yep. Took it out. And we're staking. And then it should pop up in here. DeFi earn assets. And I'm going to just let that cruise. I'm going to let that roll. For how long? I have no freaking idea, y'all. But this is what I love. This is why I fucks with cdc in the long run um i 
really feel that the ecosystem between using the card, of uh, staking for the card, because I do have the uh, DeFi Earn going on. I do have the Crow stake going on in the main account. And then I do have um, just some spare Crow um, doing work for me in the VVS DeFi uh, exchange. And then, yeah, y'all, y'all let me know if you're on uh, the Crow Coin come up to. If not, you know, eh, it is what it is, I suppose. So, yeah, y'all, let me know in the comments. I'm really interested to hear what y'all have to say. I know it's a long video, right? But it's my goodbye to the D5 wallet, my first D5 wallet, and a big mistake that cost me a thousand, and it'll continually cost me money because as the price of crow gets higher, um, yeah, I'll, I'll know what a mistake that was. <laughs> But I'm, I'm just taking it in a good stride, man. Whatever. It is what it is. Consider everything that was on that wallet a burn. Because that's what it was. And, you know, with VVS and CDC having exorbitant amounts, it just is what it is. So, yeah, y'all. Thank you for tuning in with me. Really appreciate you stopping on by. Y'all know my philosophy on this YouTube shit. View what you wanna, do what you wanna, and I'll see you lovely lads and lassies in the next episode. So until then, my friends, take care, take it easy, and peace.